Hey everybody, welcome back. We had a great run with the thief last time. Let's try to do episode six as the robot. Can't complain. I mean, that was, the thief run was extraordinarily good. It's a tough choice, right? On the one hand, pea shooter is horrible. <laughs> On the other hand, plasma blaster is well. You know, let's. I, I like rolling the dice on the dice rolls, you know? To get a one in four chance of being able to use a dice, and this is the other thing I was thinking of, is to have an extra opportunity to actually do six damage instead of merely five. That's a big positive in my world. So I think that this is, I honestly, if push came to shove, I think this is better, but I'm not fully convinced. We're not gonna kill him. We might as well go for the jackpot. We should have put the three in there so we could have activated it more easily, but uh, we should have you regardless. We have you regardless. That's not when you're supposed to return the dice game. I needed that on the previous turn. God, I hate nudge, dude. I just, I can't go through it anymore. Getting nudge is my first equipment. For, to what purpose? Oh my god, that's very good. Okay, so we definitely like this right out of the gate. Um, two ones are irrelevant. I think we'll just catch you with that right there and get lethal. How, how do you feel about that? We also get to keep our auto roll, which is fantastic. We get two extra sapu. I don't mind this, we just have to, in most circumstances, we have to try to exactly kill the enemy. Which is hard, because we don't have dice manipulation anymore. You know, that we had that as the thief, but there's no guarantee we're gonna have it, you know, as the robot at any point. Except for, you know what? Finally, we may see the most unbelievably boring and practical use of nudge. <laughs> it's finally happened. Okay, I mean, start there, I guess. Are you like, is this fun for you? Is it funny? You had to try, like... We weren't gonna kill you, uh, Sneezy, on this turn, regardless. Unless we hit the jackpot, so I, I felt like we didn't necessarily screw that one up. So, this is actually... We do want to hit you with that one. Was well, so you don't want to return the dice to me on that one? That's okay. It's a mimic, dude. Probably should have healed. Forgot you were a mimic. But your moves are not that bad, right? Ooh, very mysterious. I don't know, maybe they are that bad. Okay, I'll tell you what, we'll put a five in here. Then whatever happens here, just a nice little bonus, but I'm gonna hit you with the auto roll. And uh, I think we're just gonna hit you for five. Yikes. It's all right, you only get one piece of equipment. That's not that bad. Horrible, fantastic. Just one of these days to get the dice back at a relevant time. One shock, it's not that bad. You gotta try. We got it back. You gotta use it. Might as well put it in. That's okay. I think we're still, you know, we're beholden to the experience, you know what I mean? Like, we, we can't change what we roll. Remember, we gotta try to lethal you. I'll, I'll take one damage on the reflect, because it doesn't matter. We're gonna get back to full HP anyway. But, yeah, we gotta try to exactly kill you. Dude, honestly, Precious Egg is really good. It, it might take us a while to make it work. I actually think Slingshot is really good. 
It might sound stupid because previously it seemed kind of bad, <laughs> but uh, I think this gives us something to do with our ones, which at present are just absolutely horrible. So who am I to disagree? I've traveled the world and the seven seas and freaking everybody's looking for someone dude so now we have something to do with nudge toss it in there we got a five in return the faster we get this going the happier we're gonna be you search your feelings you know it to be true i don't really want an auto roll of one i took my one in six chance of the jackpot not all jackpot abilities are created equal you know but we're getting great value out of Precious Egg so far. Maybe Nudge Precious Egg is the dream. This is now used the six on missing score for sure. Three. It's a really tough... Uh, it's a tough one for us. Okay, that's not though. I'm like, okay. Sure it does four damage on a jackpot. I don't know, man. Hit me with two ones. Roll a four, please. Didn't roll a four or a five. Both would have been sick. But anyway, we still got you. That was still really good. It's the first time I've ever seen two ones be a viable option out of that. I'm stoked. This run seems very good. Mechanical arm, honestly, I think is garbage. I was under the impression that it was a great... It, on, and on episode one, it might be great. But I don't mind one burning die. On episode one, it might be great. I mean, it is. We, we've used it, right? But on later episodes, I'm not sure it's my cup of tea. It benefits from a different shell. Let's put it that way. I got no qualms with that one right there. Honestly, we'll use this here, I think. A six. Might as well just toss that in here. It gave us a six in return, which makes perfect sense. Um, might as well just toss this in there and, and hit you. Uh, we could bust. Let's take our guaranteed damage. Okay. It's a cowardly decision that paid dividends. You love to see it. <laughs> now remember, you gotta try to hit this guy for exact lethal. A three. We will use it. A six. Auto roll me, dude. Um, I think that was right. We got one HP out of the deal, which is not amazing, but lucky star, do one damage and roll a five. Because it has a counter, that's kind of interesting. We do need a five or a four for precious egg, but the idea is like, you know, one day we're going to get there. <laughs> At some point we're going to roll a five or a four. I promise. I don't mind the sixes. Like, we're getting a lot of value out of that as well. Okay. We could bust, so I will hit you with that right out of the game. Okay, that's fantastic. I think we should um, do eight damage and definitely just keep Precious Egg going here. Keep in mind, Precious Egg is going to give us a guaranteed six once we, uh, once we actually get it activated, which should be pretty soon. Dude, I love rolling these ones. We're going to love fighting enemies with freeze. Come on. So close. Anyway, we want to kill you. We might as well lethal you. No, we're going to get to max HP. This is a good time to try to make precious egg work. I know we had lethal, but after this fight, we're going to get to max HP anyway. If we could at least have an enduring legacy from this fight right here be that uh, we got Precious Egg close to being able to function, then that's the dream. Sorry, Tomo. I didn't mean to elbow your box, brother. Four plus nudge. Precious Egg works. Um, we could auto roll a two. I think it's super worth it. 
Yeah, I think that's that's extremely good. And then we killed you exactly. Mind you, the exact kill doesn't matter as much there. Okay, I think we're making all the right decisions. You know that song? He says all the right things at exactly the right time. But he means nothing to you and you don't know. This is the exact opposite. We're doing all the right things at exactly the right time and it means everything to me. And I do know why. Okay, well, we gotta get something out of this. This is kind of like the the most dangerous time for this run. Precious Egg does nothing uh, until we actually get it working. And we have two things that require a one. So there's some, there's some inherent danger associated with it. Oh, thank God. Um, I think you definitely just want your guaranteed sixes. Excuse me. This is not a guaranteed six. Apparently I've been granted hookshot. I did not want hookshot. If I wanted hookshot, I would have purchased it. This is an incredible ripoff. I've been... I've been had, quite honestly. I can only even use it on a two, which isn't even that good. I don't even... I don't know. Is, is it good? Is it any good at all? I feel like Precious Egg has screwed me. <laughs> this is not what I signed up for. I signed up to get a free six every single time. Being able to lock two dice is kind of interesting, admittedly, but... Wait, like, what the heck do you... Next to... Just put an even in there? Max two, do 60. Okay, this taking a one or a two is way better. So is 75% chance to return the dice, but... Having a good opportunity to do six damage... Enemies throwing dice does not bother me. That's unbothersome. I'm getting a little light on HP, though, all of it. So we rolled a natural two. Why not? Three goes into nudge. Now we can use nudge twice. Fantastic. Just what I've always wanted. The ability to nudge uh, twice in a single turn. Lucky me. I think you just go straight for it. Toss this in here. Why not? It was still an okay turn, all things considered, but our HP is dwindling. Three damage and a lock dice. It's okay, you just hope to low roll. Ah, one lock dice, even better. So, I think we like this. Let's roll one more time. Reuse next equipment. I think you gotta do this. We got a bunch of sixes. Actually, but why would we rather ever do six damage? Even if we get a 25% chance for the dice to come back, instead of eight damage. We'd like always rather have eight damage. It's four on jackpot. We'd rather do it this way though, because uh, that counter will stay low now. You are gonna heal, but only for three. Yikes. So we have to hit you for four. It's extremely simple. Beautiful. <laughs> I don't like our odds at all here. I, uh... I've been very bullish recently on, uh, on our gameplay. This one, I feel not very bullish at all. Um, and I, honestly, I feel like we did get screwed by the hook shot. I feel like that was an extreme ripoff. Again, why did I take 10 turns to get Hookshot to work? It's an item I've never purchased before in my entire life. I'm not trying to be super bitter about it, I'm just saying. So we like knowing what our dice are, because now we can do this. We get 6 damage. Can't use this here, that's... We get, use it in Nudge. Then get another 6 damage with a reroll. 
A one, that's not worth that much. A four, why not? Give it a shot. Uh, we gotta auto roll a one. I think we should auto roll. Um, not for the one specifically, but like, freezing a dice is pretty good against the bully. Just wanna make sure we can kill this guy ASAP. We're very light on HP. Yo, we saved a lot. We saved five off of the- Oh, sorry, Tom, I didn't mean to elbow your box, brother. We saved a lot. We saved. A lot. Can't bust, so roll. Can bust, so... So relax. I think you just go straight for the kill. I don't know, man. Um, I think we need... We're missing the wombo combo. We don't have the wombo combo. Spud cannon for fixed payout. I actually think that's a deal. Just because the spud cannon has been pretty terrible. Um, two of these random jackpot abilities are actually pretty solid, maybe? You know? You can get a lot of damage, damage and heal, damage and you know, damage reduction. This is a real weird one, but I think you do this. Nudge, use an additional jackpot ability. Peep the auto roller. I think we definitely like evading next attack combined with probably five damage. Um, I, I hate to put ourselves in a critical state, but I think you gotta. So we're gonna dodge five, probably. We're gonna dodge one! You're too smart for me! It's okay. It's okay, it's very smart. It was a very smart, a smart approach. Well done. We'll try again. Now, it didn't... Oh, that's right, there's a new character who complete all six bonus rounds. That didn't go according to plan, but I maintain, we got friggin' screwed by Precious Egg. If it were not for Precious Egg, we would have had nothing to worry about. Well, would I rather have Ray Gun or Pea Shooter? I would rather have Ray Gun, for sure. Pea Shooter, maybe with some counter synergy, could be okay, but it's not. Uh, it's not my cup of tea. Well. Just because you don't like what you rolled doesn't mean you had any choice in the matter. That's a good roll. Doesn't really matter, I think, where we put them here. Little to worry about. Not nudge. Even though we got to use it, I'm begging you. Okay, small shield at least gives us something to do with ones and twos. Threes are still a ray gun special. Fives are a plasma blaster. Gotta give it a shot. Um, all evens is bad, but we're gonna be at full HP no matter what, so who cares? I was gonna say, it might actually be nice for us. Uh, um, to take more damage. I think we put a two in here. Then if we roll a two, well, it doesn't matter because we're gonna have jackpot regardless. But okay, roll two ones. I'm afraid that won't be necessary. Um, it, what a terrible jackpot! But at least we get to keep our auto roll available, um, and we're gonna heal the full regardless. So it's not really like it's not a problem at all. But we need something to do more damage. Like, right now, we're at very low damage status. Both you and your enemies start each fight with fury. I do like it. Because we go first, I think this is important. Sneezy is gonna friggin' suck. <laughs> He's gonna create so many freaking 
ones, my head is gonna spin. Which is why I thought the right idea is to fight this son of a gun early. Give me an auto roll. We gotta do everything in our freaking power to get out in front of this guy. Oh, thank God. Oh, that's so much better. Like, literally, we... That's the greatest roll we ever could have asked for. So this is a pretty terrible roll, but remember, we can use Ray Gun. That's right, I haven't forgotten. It is what it is. Um, this is much worse, but it could have been so much worse. My man would have created 10 ones. I mean, I guess at the end of the day, he can only do four attacks, but he would definitely saturate his attacks. Okay, easy enough. Still going relatively strong here. Let's fight the wizard. I don't know what's gonna happen with his first action. We always, I think we gotta accept this is as good as it gets. That's our best, that's our best fury action right off the bat. My man's gonna hit me for 10 and shock four pieces of equipment. That's just absolutely horrible. But I'm glad we're fighting him now. I was like, the only thing that could bust us <laughs> is the freaking six. A five would allow us to do five damage. A six left us uh, eating it. So he could, just for the record, very easily kill me. Um, I think, I, as ridiculous as it sounds, first off, he's obviously dead now, just due to pure luck. But I think having one shield would keep him from killing us. It's a tough one for me, because Precious Egg ripped me off last time. So I guess we will do missing score, although I don't necessarily expect it to be great. Do two damage, CPU minus two. So this is a way, with evens, you could guarantee yourself a jackpot, obviously at the cost of potentially more dice in the future. So I think we always like missing score, just for the chance to get dice in return. So this will do two damage and give us a jackpot. Oh, never mind. I was totally wrong in how it worked. It still gave us a jackpot, though, because I'm a genius, but... That's a bad roll for us. He gets maximum utility. I really want to make sure he's iced this turn. So he's dead. I think you just take it. Save your auto roll. Robot is definitely harder than the thief. Like... That, I don't think there's any any dispute there. I gotta look at my backpack. Because Slingshot was pretty good for us, but... There's nothing for us to do with ones anyway. Like, we'd have to roll a natural one. I do think it's, it's decent, though. Without dice manipulation, the odds of us making it work are maybe... Yeah, sure. The odds of us making it work are maybe not that great, but we'll see. Level up in five. I'd, I'd like to fight the cactus to level up, I think. So you really want a one. Thank you. We'll get two dice out of it at no cost to ourselves. It's a pretty amazing situation, honestly. Like, you're dead, dude. I mean, like, you're not literally dead, but, like, you're pretty much deceased. So that's a dream come true. Uh, it's not gonna happen all that often, but I'll take it when I can get it. <laughs> Rolling the natural one there helped me out a lot. Spatula sword. Deal damage and flip it upside down. I think our shield is proving useless, and our ones are gonna go into... Uh, well, our ones are gonna go into the slingshot. Our twos are probably gonna go into overclock. So I think this is pretty much what we had to do. So remember our first action gets doubled. So we might not wanna act yet. Now we're, I don't wanna say we're forced into it, but we're kind of, sort of forced into it. Um, I actually don't mind doing eight damage 
and getting two threes. Tossing a three in there. Got one in return. Use a two here. Lower that by two. Roll again. We got a bunch of threes. Okay. Let's fit our threes in here. It would be super nice to kill this guy. Honestly. It doesn't really matter because we're going to be at full HP anyway, but... I was just gonna say, as long as he only rolls one even, we're we're sitting pretty here. Um, he he could hurt us pretty bad with the with the thorns, but whatever. That's pretty much the dream scenario right there. And we'll be back at full HP, which is the whole reason I chose to fight this guy to get a level regardless. And things are going okay. We got some modest synergies. Double dice value, then subtract one. We have used it, and I've actually kind of liked it, I think, but it's awkward to pronounce. So we want natural sixes or natural ones. Five is close. As long as we can't bust, this is where we're going to stay. Okay. So we, do we want to create more twos? I think we do. So you turn, you do ten damage, create a bunch of twos. Your twos allow you to pull a little lower on that one. Your five never gets any better than putting it in here, but you can put it in here and it gives you a chance to get it in return, which is a dream come true. You get a natural one. Wow. Wow. Maybe we've created the greatest robot deck of all time. Or maybe we've gotten lucky. I'll leave it up to you. I don't really understand this Pachula Sword difference. Uh, Overclock does definitely get better. Slingshot gets way better. Um... I, I think you go slingshot. It having double the efficacy. We really want to hit that with... Um, I think we want random here. Enemies can throw dice at you. Not a problem. Uh, I think we really want to be able to use... Fury with our uh, slingshot. It's beautiful when it works. We got a three and a one. Let's keep rolling for a second until we can get into bust range. Okay. So, I think you always like a two in there. Could still bust, so be careful. Um, honestly, I think you flipped the three into a four. The one into a six is not bad either. Don't get me wrong, but... Uh, kind of like that. We got And then we got a six out of it. Kind of didn't even really want the dice back, but we'll... Uh, do two damage, raise our odds of not busting. Hit you with this, hit you with this. Finally, we've had a non one turn KO. So you're gonna hit me for eight, which sucks. Hopefully we can kill you next turn. We don't have fury anymore, so it gets a little bit harder. Natural three. Natural one is really good. So you do the six, reroll. You get the five, put the five in here. Didn't get it back, that's okay. Honestly, you're done. So we'll hit you with a three. And they, uh, doesn't really matter where we put it. Everything's fine. I recognize the potential danger here. We gotta get through both of these enemies. So to kill this guy, without heals I should say. Killing this guy early is super important. Honestly, I think we'd like an auto roll to give us a five. Then the five, you go straight on this Pachula sword. That allows you to slingshot once. Twos might as well go here. There's not really a better use case. We didn't get it back, and that's okay. I think we'd like to freeze one of your dice. So you're not going to hit me too badly. He did have Fury. I forgot about that. So there is a chance we don't kill him, but we probably will kill him. We will absolutely kill him. Alright. That was a very good fight. Dude, going first is so clutch with Fury. Going second would suck. <laughs> Return the difference between the two dice is very interesting as well. Is there anything we don't like, though? Honestly, it would only be Ray Gun. But uh, I, I think that we're happy with where we're at. But Vice Grip 
it is an interesting, especially upgraded, an interesting piece of equipment. So we want a low roll and we got it. That's beautiful. So we fury that, get two dice in return for no cost. Um, you definitely just hit for six and hope to get the six in return, which you can then use with uh, Spatula Sword. Mostly for the six damage at that point, because you're not getting that much else out of it, but... Um, Well, let's do five. Well, no, because the sixth isn't worth anything else. We can't do anything else with it, so. Um, we can bust. We could bust here. I think you just do two damage. Give yourself a shot. I was still a, <laughs> like a 40 damage turn one, so. What? Oh, maybe she didn't want to use her equipment twice, but she can't get around it. She has to use it twice anyway. I don't know. It's not for me to judge, I guess. Anyway, you're dead. And we have, like, an incredible build. This is, um... <laughs> I've been working out, but... Um, this is a really... It doesn't matter. This is a really, really strong setup. What do you want? Plasma Blaster for Flaming Sword? No, I will not burn myself each turn. If you're going through hell, keep going. If you're going through heaven, for God's sake, don't mess it up. I don't want to lose our max HP on this one. You will never roll a six. Honestly, that's... Fives are better for us. I know it sounds strange, but that's not really that much of a problem. Fours, not what we want. Fives, I like it okay. Because now we can do... I don't want to risk busting here. So we'll do ten damage, create two twos. That two became a three. Um, we might as well do it this way. We can't bust. If we can't bust, we roll. That's it's just as simple. If we can't bust, we roll. And that was just absolutely fantastic. Love to see some low rolls. We're gonna get hit for six and shocked for two. Big freaking whoop. Not a problem. Well, we're gonna get hit for nine and shocked for three, but still. Not that big of a deal. Okay. Um, Would have been nice to return it, but that's fine. Definitely should have just taken the KO, but at least we got there anyway. We have a lot of different ways to ice you, dude. Like, this is a... This is a really good run. What do I owe it to? Um, my own personal incredible skill, obviously. But secondarily, the help of the community, which I really appreciate. So we want low rolls. Spatula Sword is fine. We'd rather get a natural on this one. Because that's 12 damage and 2 free dice. Um, I think we would rather flip our 2 into a 5. It does less damage, but then we get this. Didn't work, but that's okay. We can't bust, so you roll, put a five in here, five in here, two in here. To be honest, I think I like an auto-rolled three. And then hit me with a double next action. You're going to be dead next turn regardless, but this makes it easier. So we take, a, honestly, a very, very decent, acceptable amount of damage that is not that bad. And we are totally fine here. Saving the auto roll to start combat with in the future, I think, is, is my game plan. Being able to buy HP is very nice. I think we're just going to go straight for the singer. Then we got Paper Knight. I mean, I'm feeling... I'm feeling fantastic right now. A three, a two. Now we're talking. 12 damage, two free rolls. You love a five right there. Didn't come back. Life goes on. Um, can bust. Can't bust. Can't bust. Can't bust. Okay. I think we go for the auto roll. Eight firebomb damage. Three extra damage there. 46 damage turn one. 
we are gonna get two weakness and a little bit of damage. Not a big concern. I really feel like we got the, the whole world in the palm of our freaking hands right now. A two? Well, you know, it's easy enough. You should have gone for the clock. Not a bad fight. Um, nudge. I'm gonna go straight for the upgrade here. So I think the upgrade... Overclock does get better. Um, missing score though, I mean, seems to be... It's... The active effect, or the, sorry, the roll effect on it is three times as good. It goes from 25% to 75%. You're still subject to the whims of randomness, but I mean, come on. Okay, here you're kind of stuck. You gotta do this Pachula Sword. It's still pretty good. You get 10 damage, you get another 6 out of that. You gotta go missing score here. Honestly, might as well put a 2 in here. Might as well put a 5 in here. It's not getting any better than that. Might as well put a 6 in here. Hit you with one of those. That was a great turn. We still did 34 damage. We are going to take 18. <laughs> That's bad. To be clear. But Fury is now gone. First roll being locked sucked pretty bad. But we still got there. 2. I think you... Uh, let's... Uh, twos are just pretty much good to go into overclock, I think. Wow, dude, it's it's just that easy. We have an incredible run. This might be... I've said this a lot recently, but I want to point out there was a time I never thought we'd say this again in Dicey Dungeons. This is one of the most fun runs I've ever had. So you are a shield unit. Um, I think we damage you too fast for your shields to affect me. Fury is dangerous, though. You can put up a ton of shield uh, early. One is perfect. Love to see it. Totally fine with that. Five just works best there. Honestly, I think you throw your six in there. I know it's a little wonky, but... Let's put a five into here. You can lower. Lower. One is pretty bad. Two is pretty bad. Four is fine. I'm gonna auto roll a three. And uh, I guess we'll barricade. It's not great, to be honest, but we did do 40 damage. So you're gonna put up 16 shield. That's horrible. <laughs> That's extremely bad, but okay. Very nice, two turn into a six. Six came back to us. We've almost punched through the shield. We got a two. Just goes right in there. Two. Goes right in there. One. I'd rather do six damage and create a bunch of useless ones. Honestly. We gotta we gotta chunk it down a little bit here. Are you having a laugh? Is that is that your thing? Eight firebomb damage, please. It's just that easy. We She wouldn't have killed us on the next turn. We, we were out in front of her. We got nothing to worry about. For now, thanks for watching. That was another great run. If you enjoyed it, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. See ya!